Hi guys, Disney Toys Review here. Today we have Mega Blocks. These are Block Buddies, the three little pigs. There's the big bad wolf. Here's the little piggy who built his house with straw. Here's the little piggy who built his house with sticks. Here's the little piggy who built his house with bricks. You can download the booklet of your favorite story. You can also find Little Red Riding Hood. Let's open the three little pigs. Let's take a close look at this playset. It's time to go build a house. Let's get started. I'm gonna build one out of straw. That sounds like a great idea. It will protect me from the big bad wolves. Here we go. My house is done. I'm gonna go take a nap. I don't think he made a very good choice. I think the big bad wolf will be able to blow his house down. I'm going to make mine out of sticks. Yay! That will surely keep the big bad wolf away. Wow, my house is ready. It's time to rest. Mega blocks. He doesn't look very safe to me. I think he shouldn't have built his house out of straw. And he doesn't look very safe either. There's no door on his house. He shouldn't build a house out of sticks. He needs to build it out of bricks. Oh, this is a hard job. Yay, I'm finally finished. I'm going to go in and rest. The brick house comes complete with a little table and some food. Oh, I really am so very hungry. Mmm, mm, that's very good food. Ha ha, I'm the big bad wolf and I'm gonna go blow the house down. Ha 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 ha. Oh, the wolf is here, I've got to get away. I'm gonna go to my brother's house. Do you think we'll be safe here? Oh yes, my house is very strong. Here comes the wolf. <laughs> oh no, the house is breaking. We need to go to our brother's house. Let's go. Who's there? It's us! The big bad wolf is coming! The big bad wolf is coming! Please let us in! Hurry inside then! Mega blocks. It looks like we're all safe and just in time! Ooh, this is a big strong house! I bet all the piggies are there, and I'm really hungry for some piggies. <laughs> it did not blow down or break. It's very strong. I'm going to see if I can get in another way. Ooh, maybe I can get in by the fireplace. It's all right, he's on the fireplace. We're gonna have him for dinner. 
Your house was the strongest. Your house was the best. You are the smartest pig we know. Yeah. Tops above the rest. Thanks, everybody. Oh. Oh, it's so good. Oh. This set has Hansel. He's a rabbit. All we need is to supply Gretel. Yay! Here's a ladle that goes in this pot that they can make a soup in. We also have this table. The playset on the inside is a house. And on the outside is part of the woods and lots of candy in front of the house. We have candy canes and cookies and little chocolate covered candies. And even on the house we have some jelly beans and some wrapped candy. Mmm, it looks delicious. The door opens and closes. This is a fun set for our Once Upon a Time series. Peppa and her friends have just finished their work and it's story time now. Peppa's feeling very sleepy though. I'm so tired. Okay children, I'm going to read you a story. Once upon a time, there was a little boy and a little girl named Hansel and Gretel. They lived at the edge of the forest with their father who was a poor woodcutter and with their mean stepmother. Oh, I'm really tired. The mean stepmother made the father take them into the forest one day and abandon them, <sighs> hoping they wouldn't find their way home. I don't know the way back to my house. How will I ever get home? Oh, I don't know. Maybe it's this way. Where could it be? I can't find my crumbs. Where's my house? Ooh, that's not my house, but it looks nice. I'm so very, very hungry. And look, I see some cookies and some candy. Oh, mm. oh it's so good. Mm. Oh, mm. oh, oh. Who is at my house? You there! Oh, wait. Hello! Come inside. I will give you something to eat and help you find your way home. Yay! I know you must be very hungry. Oh, yes, I am. Have some soup out of this bowl. Oh, thank you. You're so nice! That's what you think. Ha, ha, ha. You are now my servant. You may not leave. Do you have someone else with you? Yeah, my brother is out there. I I could go get him. Oh, no, that's okay. I will find him. I'll be back soon. And I will lock the door so she cannot get out. Hmm, I think I'm going to go have a cookie. Oh, no. I can't get out. I'm trapped inside. Oh, dear. Maybe this isn't a good plan after all. I have found him and we're going to lock him in a cage and you will not leave without him, will you? No, I can never leave him behind. Then you will be my slave. Okay. Every day you must feed him and fatten him up because I want to eat him in a wonderful yummy lamb stew. A wonderful yummy rabbit stew. Oh, oh please don't eat him. You have no say in this. Do the work. So Peppa stayed busy cleaning and cleaning. All day long she cleaned and cleaned and fed the rabbit. Oh, it's so tiring. I don't even get to sleep. Oh, oh. Oh, oh I'm so sleepy. I'm so sleep. Get up! You're not allowed to sleep! Oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just fell asleep. I'm sorry. And Peppa kept working and working and working and working and working. She was hungry and tired. Oh, dear. Until one day, 
the Wicked Witch came in and said, It is time for you to fetch me a pot of water to make my rabbit stew. Oh no, please don't eat him, please. Do not argue with me. Go. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And she brought the kettle. But she acted like she didn't know how to make a fire. It's not, it's just not hot enough. Can you check it? And when the Wicked Witch went in to check it, Peppa pushed her into the pot and into the fire. Wah! Ha! Let's see if I can get out now. And she went outside and rescued her friend. I'm so glad you're okay. Oh yes, I feel very happy and very full. I've been eating so much food. Oh, we must get out of here. Come on. And Hansel and Gretel found a wonderful treasure. And they took it home to their father. And they all lived happily ever after. Peppa, oh, ah, ah, ah. I wonder what has happened to Peppa. She looks really scared. She must have had a bad dream. And Mama, and, and, and she was a witch, and she was... Oh, Peppa, I think you must have been dreaming. Madame Gazelle would never be a wicked witch. Oh, yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, I hope I didn't embarrass myself. By running away from school? Hmm, you might have. Oh, well, I'll find out tomorrow. Good night, Mama. Oh, look at that beautiful backdrop. This one also has a beautiful backdrop too. Let's check out these two sets. In this set, we have a beautiful bell. She's in a beautiful red and yellow gown. It's so pretty. She's got on black shoes and she has on a yellow undergarment. This is a traditional dress from the movie. You can also put her in your clip-on dresses. This set also has a head that changes and we can do a classic bell. Now she's dressed just like in the movie in the first scene. Wow! In this set, we also have Chip and Mrs. Potts. Aww. We also have a little basket and a book. In our other set, we have another bell in her beautiful yellow ball gown. We can also change her into this gown. Oh, they're both so beautiful. We have the enchanted rose, and we even have a place to let them be able to hold it. Here's Lumiere. My sweet, please come into my castle and be with me. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, ho. I really love the design. Be our guest. Be our guest. Put our service to the test. And here is Glogsworth. He even has a place to wind him up. How fun! Finally, we have the prince. His legs can bend. And his arms can move too. We also have this. 
The beast! It's so much fun to play with the beast! And when it's time, you can make the beast transform into the prince! How amazing is that? Oh! Here's my little town! It's such a quiet village! Every day is like the one before! Like the story! It's where she meets Prince Charming! Oh, it's such a beautiful story! I've gotta go get a new book! Oh, he said I could keep it because it's my favorite book! I just love this story! It's where she meets Prince Charming! Oh, it's such an amazing story! I'm gonna go through a walk in the forest! Oh, what a beautiful castle! I wonder who lives here. We have a guest. Oh, well, you know what the master says. Oh, don't worry. Be our guest. Be our guest. Put our service to the test. <laughs> oh, this is such a wonderful place. And look, such enchanted little creatures. Roar! Who is that? Uh, I think that's the master calling. We better be going. Why are they running away from the master, and why does he sound like that? Who are you, and what are you doing in my castle? Uh, 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 I'm sorry, sir. I I was just walking through the forest. Uh, there's just something about your eyes. Oh, I think, I think I'm falling in love with you. Really? Maybe she will be the one to break the curse. What curse? Uh, nothing. Let me show you my castle. It's such a beautiful castle. I really do like it. Oh, and I really like you. In fact, I think I love you. You love me? Yes, I do. Whoa! You broke the curse! <gasps> Uh, what just happened? Where did the beast go? There's something about your eyes. It's you. You're, you were, you are, you were the beast? Yes, there was an enchanted curse. Oh, and now we'll live happily ever after. Oh, my forest friends. But what is this? Oh! The dress-up set comes with Aurora. She has on a beautiful crown. She's also wearing a beautiful pink gown. Look at her beautiful pink shoes. This set comes with a second dress. It's a lovely white and black dress. We have a cute little squirrel forest friend. And a cute little rabbit too. Oh, they're really sweet. Let's see what's in our second dress up set. This set comes with the spindle that Sleeping Beauty poked her finger on. Be careful! We also have the good fairies. They're on this really cool stand. Here is Aurora in a beautiful blue gown.
This Aurora has beautiful gold slippers on. And she has two more dresses. She has this yellow gown. And this beautiful white and pink gown. It's so much fun to have these sets and these characters. La la la, the snow is passing. There are wonderful things to find. Oh, la 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 la. Oh, what is this over here? No, 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 no. No, no. Oh, my forest friends, but what is this? Oh. oh no, oh no, find the prince. Yes, we must find the prince. Oh no, what's happened? Oh, my dear sweet Aurora. Something happened to you. You were sleeping in the snow. Oh, it must have been from that evil spindle. Thank you for saving me. La 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 la. We're on the right trail, Bear. Let's go find that goose. So cool. Look, we have Pogo Stick. Goldie can ride on top of it. Ha ha ha! So can Little Red Riding Hood. That's so fun. Here's Goldie. I love her pink headband. And look at her golden curls. She's poseable. We can move her arms and her legs. She's wearing a beautiful blue dress and look at her beautiful pink shoes. So fun! Here's Little Red Riding Hood. She's wearing her Little Red Riding Hood. <laughs> That's so funny. She's not posable, but I really love her position and I love her outfit. Here's Humpty. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Oh, I just don't like that poem. <laughs> Sorry, Humpty. Look at his hat and his glasses. Oh, he's so much fun. Here we have the big bad wolf. I'm not so bad after all. That's just a silly name. I'm really quite fun to be around. He's wearing this really fun vest. Here we have Bricks. Bricks is ready to put his house up. He's going to be using strong building materials. Only the best for me. Here's Twigs. I think a straw twiggy house is just perfect. I want to find out how it stands up to the weather. We also have Baby. She's ready to put up a house, too. I love building and construction. <laughs> Finally, we have Bear. Look, he's posable, too. I love his green long sleeve shirt. And I love that his bare legs can move, too, so he can sit down or stand up. But shouldn't we get to Fairytale Forest and have lots of fun? That sounds like a great idea. Let's go. Hi, Ben. Hi, Goldie. We're going on an adventure today. 
Really? Yeah, didn't you hear? The goose that lays the golden egg is missing! Missing? We've got to help them find it! Ooh, and go all over the fairy tale forest! That sounds like so much fun! Let's go! I don't know where to start looking. Hmm. Where would we look to find a goose? Hey, I think I saw it go that way. Let's go. La 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 la. Oh wow! Did you see that pretty goose? Hi, little Red Riding Hood. Have you seen a goose come this way? Oh, yes, I did. It went that way. Thanks. We're on the right trail, Bear. Let's go find that goose. Thanks, Little Red Riding Hood. No, we need to make our house out of bricks. No, that'll take too long. I think straw is fine. Straw won't work well. Why don't we do twigs? No, we need to do it out of bricks. That'll withstand anything. Oh, hi, three little pigs. Hi, Goldie. Hi, Bear. What are you guys doing? We can't decide what to make our house out of. Oh, I'm sure you could figure out something, though I think bricks will be the most sturdy. Hey, have you seen a goose come this way? Yeah, he went that way. We're still on the right trail, Bear. Let's go. Thanks, guys. Hope you figure out what to make your house out of. Straw! Sticks! Bricks all the way! Oh, just a little bit further and I'll be able to get on this fence. Whoa! That's a big goose. Hey, Humpty, what are you doing? Oh, I'm just going to sit on this fence for a little while and rest. Do you really think that's such a good idea, Humpty? Don't you remember the last time when you sat on that wall? This time will be different. Hey, Humpty, have you seen a goose come this way? Sure, it went that way. Great, thanks, Humpty. Let's go, Goldie. Be careful, Humpty! Okay, just a little bit further. Oh, see? That's not so ah, bad! I'm okay. I'm okay. Hmm, I wonder where I can get a snack. I'm so very hungry. That tickles. Oh, stop. <laughs> oh, I think the goose likes me. Oh, that's silly. Hey, stop, goose, stop. Hey, Big Bad, have you seen that? Oh, I see the goose. Um, we have to get the goose. I think he likes me a little too much. Maybe you could come with us and we can take him back to the beanstalk. Yeah, could you help us, Big Bad? He looks like he's kind of attached to you. <laughs> yeah, sure. Let's go. Great. Thanks, Big Bad. Now that we've taken the goose back, I want to get something to eat. Hey, Big Bad. You won't believe it. The goose laid a golden egg. And Jack said I could give it to you for helping. Ooh. <laughs> I'm going to go build the fastest house ever. Sometimes fast is not the best. Whatever. I'm going to be done before you're done. I've got a brilliant plan. It's going to go so great. It's going to be the best. Sometimes fastest is not the best. Oh, yeah, whatever. This is hard work, but I'll be done really soon. <laughs> Just a little bit more hay and we'll be all ready to build. Ah, ah. 
Ah, uh, ooh, I think I'm ready for a break. Ah, so nice. Hey, Bailey. Hey, Big Bad. I hope you're taking your time getting ready for the competition. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna win. I'm gonna be the fastest and the best. Well, you do know I get to try to blow down everybody's house. Yeah, no worries. I got this, Big Bad. Thanks for the words of advice. See you later. Okay, I'm getting my puffer all ready to puff. <gasps> <laughs> oh, this is hard work, but it's going really well. Ha! Huh, I'm the hardest worker here. Hey, Twigs! Hey, Big Bad! What are you doing? I'm getting ready for the competition. I bet you won't be able to blow down my house. I'm using strong wooden logs. Well, you better plan carefully because I've been practicing. <gasps> Whoa, Big Bad, that's quite a puffer you got there. I've got this, Big Bad. We'll see you later at the competition. Okay. Hmm, let's see if all my calculations are correct. Yeah, double checked, triple checked. Yeah, hmm? Mm hmm Looks great. I'm gonna go get my supplies now. This is gonna take too long. I need to get some help. Bring it right over here. Perfect. Now I just have to plan where everything goes. Hey, Bricks. Hey, Big Bad. Are you getting ready for the competition, too? Sure thing. I'm going to build the best house, and you won't be able to blow it down ever. Oh, that's great. I can't wait to see you at the competition. It looks like you really have a handle on things. See you later. Hmm, now to get ready for the competition. That's a long enough break. Now to get my house ready. Oh. Oh. Just put this here. If I just put this here. Wow, it's so light and airy. I love it. I just have one more piece to do. Right there. It'll be so nice and comfortable on a beautiful hot summer day. Wow, I really like the size of this house. Let's get it finished. Okay, just a little bit more and my house will be done. Wow, my house looks awesome! Woo! It's tough, but it's coming along great! Let's put the door on! <laughs> wow! I love my house! I think it'll do great in the competition! It's time for the competition to begin! Ooh, this is going to be so much fun. I love huffing and puffing and blowing houses down. Woo, 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 woo. Okay, Big Bad, let's see what you could do. <gasps> it's actually stronger than I thought. I'm going to need a bigger breath. <gasps> Yay! I did it! Aww! I guess I'll have to try better next time. Ah! Oh, I 
can never win this competition. Let's see how mine holds up against the big bad wolf. <laughs> Looks pretty strong. Let's give it a huff. <gasps> it's not moving at all. I'm going to have to use more power. <gasps> it's shifting. I've got one more try. Let's see if we can make it fall down. <sighs> Looks like I got this one too. Aww. That's okay. Maybe I'll win next time. Bricks, that's a mighty fine house you've got there. I can't wait to blow it down. Let's just see you try. <sighs> Let me try one more time. Just one more time, please. I know I can get it down. Okay, one more time. <sighs> oh, Bricks, that's an amazing house you've got there. It looks like you're our winner. Oh, that was in a mighty fine house, Bricks. Let me bring you your prize. Congratulations, Bricks. We've got dinner. Let's eat. <laughs> Thanks, Big Bad. Thanks, Big Bad. <laughs> Grandmother, you're looking awfully pale and a little gray. I just didn't feel good, my dear. There's the cute wolf. He's wearing overalls and has black shoes on. Here's Little Red Riding Hood. She's wearing her red cape. And she has a basket with goodies for her grandma. She's got a braided hair. And I love her cute red shoes. Here is grandma. She's got a yellow flower in her hair. And she's wearing glasses. She's got on a purple apron. Oh, she's so cute. This is a cute little house. Look at the wooden door. It can open and close. There's also this cute orange window with red drapes inside. There are three buttons for three different sounds. At the top, we have a bed for Grandma. She's got this nice rug, too. There's another window on this side. It's such a cute little house. La 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 la. Ooh, look, a toy store. Oh, but I can't stop. I'm going to my grandmother's house. La 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 la. Mama said to follow the path to the woods and to not talk to any strangers. La 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 Hello, what a beautiful song you're singing, my love. Uh, uh, I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Uh, thank you. I've got to go. Goodbye. Oh, wait, wait, my dear. What do you have in your basket? Oh, um, uh, nothing, sir. Nothing? Carrying a basket for no reason? Um, what? Well, uh, I'm just, uh, mm, uh, I'm taking something to my grandmother. I must go now. To your grandmother? Uh, yes, sir, I've got to go. What do you have in your basket? Uh, just some, uh, just some food. 
Oh, I'm so hungry. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Oh, okay then. You better go. Okay. I've got to go. La 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 la. Hmm. She's going to her grandmother's house. Maybe I can get there first. La 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 My granddaughter should be here soon. I don't see her out the window yet. Hmm. Maybe I'll start boiling some tea. Oh, that must be my granddaughter. Oh, there's nobody there. How strange. Hmm. Oh dear, it's a wolf. I'm going to need you to go away for a little bit. I want the treat your granddaughter is bringing. Oh dear, oh dear. Ah! I'm suddenly feeling very sick. <coughs> la 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 la. I'm sure glad I made it to grandmother's house. It's time to go inside. Grandmother! Come in, my dear. I'm not feeling so well. I'm in my bed. Oh, dear. Grandmother is not feeling very well. Oh, Grandmother, I'll be right up to say hello. Grandmother, you're looking awfully pale and a little gray. I just don't feel good, my dear. And you have a really long nose. Oh, oh, I just... Oh, <laughs> oh what big sharp teeth you have, Grandmother. <laughs> I'm going to go put these muffins down on the table, okay, Grandmother? Oh, no, dear, just bring them to me. Oh, no, I don't think I want to. I'll see you in a few minutes. She knows it's me. I must go get those muffins. I love muffins. No, give me the muffins. Ah! What did you do with my grandmother? Give me the muffins. No, they're for my grandmother. You're a naughty, naughty wolf. I'm, uh, uh, I'm just so... So very hungry, dear. What did you do with my grandmother? She ran away into the forest. And why did you try to trick me? That's not nice. I didn't think you'd give me muffins any other way. Of course I would. All you have to do is ask nicely. Um, I don't know how to do that. It's really easy. You just say please and thank you. Oh, okay. Can, can I have a muffin? Now? Please? You don't demand it. You ask nicely, like this. Can I have a muffin, please? Can I have a muffin, please? Sure, but don't forget to say thank you. Okay. Here you go. Thank you. I'm going to go back to the woods now. La, 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 la. Oh, 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 dear granddaughter, I went into the woods looking for you. There was a big bad wolf here. Is he still here? No, I taught him how to be a polite wolf. Hi, grandmother. I love you. Oh, I love you too. What a big castle! Yes, indeed, it's humongous. Oh, Mickey, I'm so glad you're back. Hi, Minnie. Did you happen to buy some food? I'm sorry, Minnie. I didn't have enough money. I only got some magic seeds. I think they're beans. What are we going to eat tonight if you couldn't buy any food? I don't know, but I'm going to plant the seeds over there. Maybe they'll grow some humongous bean plants that we can eat. Just plant them in a hole right down here. Okay. 
I guess we should just go inside and go to bed, Minnie. Oh, I'm so hungry. What can we do, Minnie? We don't have anything to eat. So Mickey and Minnie went to sleep. When Mickey woke up in the morning, he went outside to check where he planted his beans. Oh, Minnie! Minnie! Minnie, where are you? But Mickey couldn't find Minnie anywhere. <gasps> oh no! Minnie's gone! I wonder what's at the top of this beanstalk. So Mickey brought in a friend. Hiya, Mickey! Hey, Goofy, come up with me up this beanstalk. Okay. And away they went, climbing and climbing, all the way to the top. Meanwhile, the bad giant Pete had taken Minnie. I have jobs for you to do. Oh, please, dear sweet giant, don't hurt me, please. If you do what I say, I will not eat you tonight for dinner. Fee, fi, fo, fum. I smell the blood of an Englishman. Ha, 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 ha. What do you need me to do? Just wash all those dishes. Oh, dear. Yes, big giant, sir. Yes, I'll do whatever you say. Let me put you on the ground so you can get to the dishes. Oh, I'm going to go upstairs and rest. Ha, 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 ha. And she worked and she worked, locked in the castle day after day, washing all the dishes. Oh, oh, there are just so many dishes all the time to wash. And each day she hoped that Pete would not eat her for dinner. All the time that Minnie was trapped by the giant, Goofy and Mickey were climbing the vine. Finally, they got to the top. They traveled all the way through all the clouds. Golly gee, look, there's a castle here. It's humongous. It must be where Minnie is. And it must belong to a giant. We have to rescue her, Goofy. Let's go all the way up. I don't know if it's a good idea or not, but it's the only way. We can get over the castle wall right here. What a big castle. Yes, indeed, it's humongous. Let's get down these giant steps. Ah, ah, they're as big as we are. Ah, 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 ah. I made it. Come on down, Mickey. The giant might hear us. But the giant was sleeping. If we're very quiet, we can get by. His foot is as big as my head. Minnie was working hard where she always worked. Washing dishes and clothes and all sorts of things for the giant. She heard a strange noise. Oh, my savior, it's Mickey Mouse. Oh, Mickey, you came here to save me. Shh, we don't want to wake up the giant. No, we don't, or he might eat us for dinner. Let me help you out. Okay, Minnie, we got you out of there now to get you back down to our house. Just be careful not to wake up the giant. And so Goofy, Minnie, and Mickey worked hard to get up the stairs again and out to the vine. Down the vine we go. We've got to get out of here quickly before the giant wakes up. They were nearly down the vine when the giant woke up. Oh, where is my Minnie? A fee fi fo fum I smell the blood of an Englishman. Oh, we must hurry down the vine. Let's go, let's go.
When Pete saw them, he started climbing down the vine too. They climbed and they climbed and they climbed. And finally they were down again. Now it's time to get rid of that awful vine. Yes, we need to cut it down quickly before the giant comes back. Okay, sounds like a plan. But I don't have an axe. I think I'm going to go get my car instead. So Mickey hooked the cable to the vine and started pulling with his car. And he pulled. And he pulled. And he finally started loosening up the vine. Oh, before long, the vine came tumbling down. Yay! We did it just in time. Now the giant won't come get us. Why don't you guys come over to my house for a barbecue? Oh, Goofy, that's so nice of you. We didn't have anything to eat, which is why we planted these magic seeds. Why didn't you ask? Friends are here to help one another. Oh, I'm so ashamed. We didn't think about that. Thank you guys for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned right here on Disney Toys Review for more videos with your favorite toys.